Good afternoon, Real Verde Dan Cutler here with a quick golf course update. Just wanted to update on the phases with that email that went out a couple of weeks ago. Phase one, overseed both golf courses. That phase is obviously complete. Very happy with the overseed. The results on Whiteling have been great so far. Uh, similar results on Quail. The only thing on Quail, you will, we'll be doing some sodding next week prior to opening on number six Quail, especially where we had all the damage from the summer. I uh, just want to get those areas patched up so we can play as a par five throughout the season. Uh, secondly, phase two, we were addressing the bunkers. We're about 60% through the bunkers. A lot of the white wing bunkers that were the worst have been addressed. Uh, once we can get all on quail uh, onto the golf course, we'll be addressing those bunkers. Some of them were already addressed before the overseed. And, and in the meantime, we've been able to catch up a lot on the string trimming, the edging in the cart pass. So that progress is, is going great. So we're ha very happy with that phase three. And then phase four, also some addressing of the uh, landscapes. We have been able to get some guys over in those areas too. So very happy with the progress of the phases. We've got the, the ship heading in the right direction. Uh, very happy with the results of the golf course. Green speeds will continue to get faster as we move forward into the, into the winter. We just don't wanna mow the greens down really fast right now. And, and, and compromise the health of the greens in the short term for speeds when we got to make it a full seven months so just be patient with the green speeds we will continue to lower heights mow and roll uh, and they will continue to, to speed up but so far white wing i think the green speeds are pretty good for this early in the season just expect those to get faster as we move through hope everybody has a great week and i'll see you on the golf course